you think you're seeing. And that's a lot of what a lot of beings do when they manipulate the Venus lights or when they manipulate the Mars lights. You, like I said, Venus comes to you like love, appreciation, value, how you relate. So look at the close things, look at the close people, places, and things that you value in your life, that you relate to in your life, that you compromise with in your life. And, and look and really dissect it and look through the light. Like I said, travel in the yin realm. Y'all know my yin realm direction video. Y'all go to that. Um, travel in the yin realm and see if that light actually the color that it actually showing itself. And light's going to come in colors. You're going to know colors. Blue is like information. You know what I'm saying? Communication. Yellow is like happy, optimistic. Um, you know what I'm saying? Friendly. You know what I'm saying? Red is like aggressive, angry. You know what I'm saying? Passionate. You see what I'm saying? Purple is like royalty, um, um, prestige. You know what I'm saying? Status. You know what I'm saying? Orange orange is like kind of vibrant. You know what I'm saying? Uh like very vibrant, kind of kind of passionate, but a happy passionate. You see what I'm saying? When we start mixturing colors and stuff like that. Green, green is stability. You know what I'm saying? Green is growth. You saying green is grass, green is trees, green is weed. You see what I'm saying? Green green is also information also. Brown is texture. Brown is earth. Brown brown is energy. So anytime you wear anytime you wearing brown, you're trying to ground something. So this is why this is why a lot of tuxedos and a lot of business people the the only colors that's really presentable is like brown, silver, dark blue. You see what I'm saying? Because silver represents like Saturn energy. Silver, uh, practical stability. Brown represents. Uh, Grounding yourself, you know what I'm saying? Stabilizing yourself. A foundation. Earth. Earth is share a lot of qualities with Saturn. You see what I'm saying? Dark blue. That's night. That's yin. That's having a, a lot of people who wear dark blue suits. They they these are the uh the manipulative business people. You know what I'm saying? People got dark blue ties. They have alternative motives. Cause even though they're trying to gain structure, they're trying to gain structure from other people's energy, other people's emotional stance, other people's feelings. So this is why a lot of times business people, the majority, the majority you always see tuxedo that they in is blue, dark blue. You see what I'm saying? Because when you when you indulge in a business, a lot of times that that involves that involves that uh, a manipulation into a certain degree anyway, an illusion, a light. You see what I'm saying? All this is being utilized from Venus. Love, appreciation, value, what you pleasure. And if a lot of things you value here is pretty, look at money. Money, that, the, they, used the, they used money and they're using a lot of Venus and Saturn energy to, to, for the frequency to put it out, right? You can't even get what you love, appreciate, and value. Or you can't even get your habits. You can't get your bad habits. You can't even get your good habits without money in this realm of reality. So you see how they use the Venus light, right? And then you got to give a lot, of, a lot of your Saturn hard work. A lot of your Saturn energy. Shit you shouldn't even be working on. You should be working on yourself. You, they, they give you realms of realities and portals to work on. Cobalt. Are you in a real life cobalt mine, motherfucker? You know what I'm saying? You got to use all your Saturn energy to, to, to receive some Venus. You got you to gotta, you gotta do some shit that don't even reflect light first. You know what I'm saying? You uh, you don't like to be at work. You don't, you don't even like to work on shit that, that you creatively like to do. Don't you wish you could just creatively put out your mind, your creativity, right? It's, we in a fucking realm of reality. You got to work on your goddamn creativity. You see, see how that goddamn shit work? Shit crazy. We need to attack these motherfucking beings, whatever that's out here. But I'm just telling you from right now for the sake of this video. You got motherfucking Saturn. They, they throw you in Saturn, a place where there's no light, no energy, no happiness, you know what I'm saying? No optimism, no creativity. This is a place of dryness and hard work in order, in order for you to receive any other of your planet alignments. You know what I'm saying? That's fucking crazy. You know what I'm saying? And, and don't, you can't blame it on nobody but yourself and the intellectual beings that you're around and who you give attention to. You know what I'm saying? I'm speaking for my soul group. Now, I know that things seem impossible, but that's just because the the orb is a lot smaller than the orb that's already out here. But that's why we're on this fight every day. And the more and more we continue this fight, the more and more we're going to get a bigger orb. And the more and more that orb is going to be able to overtake the orb that's already here. And we're going to be able to really do some creation shit here. You feel me? And, and use the light in a way that light is supposed to be used. Now, like I said, Light too much light could make you blind. So make sure you put on, make sure you put on some motherfucking, oh damn, I missed my glasses. Yeah. Make sure you put on some motherfucking shades every now and then when it's too sunny and bright. And I ain't just talking about the weather. 
Now that's now that's that's with anything. You got a person who's showing too many actions, talking too much, expressing themselves too much. Boom, they giving off too much light. Make sure you put a little bit of. Make sure you put your glasses on a little bit. You know what I'm saying? So you can kind of not get blinded for whatever good game they got and be able to see through that shit. Flight boss, bitch. Goddamn air.